This is really the best shit fucking ever. This really is the way to become like the climate. Just gotta weather it. Took me 50 years of life, 25 years of work. So this is what I'm looking. This is what you want me to look at the fire that it, the multiple fire shot. I want you to wait. wait I'm going to run back down. I'm going to run down. Just stay like that. Turn the up a little bit. Here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Well. You hear me now, right? Dead? Papa! You don't hear anything? I wonder if you look at this. This is not really the case. We'll see. Just. I don't have to be clear there. I understand you guys are in charge of them. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Well, the story I heard is about a sheriff here. I'll have to say, I said, okay. I'm going to have to go to the road and get some more. Hello? Can you hear me now? Papa. You can't hear me, right? Now I can. I can hear the whole show. I didn't realize was... it was both. It was set up both ways. Yeah, unless you press the little microphone. Um, yeah, people can hear you unless you mute the microphone. The sound is very good, right? It should be. So if I push the microphone, it'll mute my side. Yeah. Fuck, I still have a problem. Like, how do I write? I think I've searched for something. Yeah, that works. Well, I'll tell you what I have to do. I have to I have to press Apple tab until the computer... Are you still seeing all the things at once? Yeah. Um, all right, hold on. Tell me if it changes. You can see things on the screen now or no? Yeah, I can still see all the different video views. No, now they all went away except for one. Hello? Yeah. Yes, I can read this. Uh, let's see one more thing. Hold on. Um... All right, um, just give me something to type real quick. Let's see. Give me something to type real quick. 
<laughs> the lake looks good after cleaning up the seaweed. No. Um, right, how do I do? Let's see. Let me think of one. Um, what's something you know? What's an idea you like? Um, okay, one. You just get up to my bottles. You know, you right, this will be too hard, actually. It's very hard. Like, I can't read what I'm actually like. It's actually the best way to write. Like, it's recording all the words that I'm writing, but I can't see them. Shit. See, didn't I really mess something up? And. Is that right, Master Beethoven? Yeah. Wow, have you heard of Master Beethoven? It's fucking great. You know, Dad, you know, it could be fun. Um, you know, you know, like you like me to think small, right? So, like, nothing says that you can't build a deep fake lake that only has four houses on it, right? Like, or six houses, right? Like, six houses is perfect. It's not that big. The cost of dynamite is not that serious. Like, done right, calculated correctly, the entire thing gets blown up in one explosion, and then it gets flooded, and our floating dirt vacuums evacuate everything. It's not, it's, I mean, it's a couple hundred thousand or maybe a million to build an amazing lake. All right, you can hang up now. Um, but you should, you should... You should learn to desire a volatile electric wagon before you have one. You, nope. you don't want you don't want you don't want to be anybody's Al. I mean, God love Al, but I mean Al's dad. That that was probably an interesting guy. All right, gotcha. Bye. Love you. Good night. How do I turn the damn thing off? You swipe up from the bottom of the phone, like drag up, and and then. Pick it and swipe it up, and it closes. Or you can, I mean, that's the best way. Just swipe up from the bottom until you see all the apps and just swipe it away. It'll Wait. working for me, but. Or you can hire an Indian guy. You can just be like, Ramesh, turn off Discord. And he'd be like, Yes, sir, Ron. And he'll charge you like 10 cents. Ramesh is now rich as fuck. I mean, I could kick you out, but I, I don't have access to any of my devices. Oh, fuck. Excuse me.
Gizzy. Oh, fuck. Gizzy. Gizzy, guess what? Gizzy. Gizzy, you should, you should be able to hear me, dude. Gizzy, 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 Gizzy. Gizzy, don't make me right, dude. Don't make Master Beethoven right tonight. Let's get some work done with two fucking black sheep white nights tonight. Gizzy! The Gizzician. The Metaphysician. I never met a physicalist. We're upset. I say Giz and we, we have no Giz voice. What the fuck's going on? Erection when when intelligent people stop around and then when they can't talk <laughs> everything is off. <coughs> this is a great setup. It's fucking crazy, right? Like this is mass, master Beethoven level, which is a pretty high level. And I told that to one of my twelve-year-old daughter's friends, and he went around the whole the school the next day just saying master Beethoven to everybody. I don't think it's like, it's not like, I'm, I'm pretty like fucked up like when it comes to like talking to my daughter's friends, but it's fine, I hope. Like they're just little wild animals, like I'm emotionally approximately the same age as these fucking kids anyways, and like I do record everything, so if some dad complains about it, listen, dude, like listen to what actually happened, and then if you want to randomly select any other hour of my life, you'll see like this is how I am, but. I also protect the shit out of my daughter and her friends. And they're, they're trash mouths as fuck anyway. It's like they're not even going to be allowed in the comm university. Yo, you know we're going to have a curse jar, right? Like there's going to be, like I think there's going to be a community balanced curse jar. And if you use like slurs, I think it's going to be super expensive. I think like a white dude says the N word, it's like a thousand dollars. Like a thousand dollars. So like. Go ahead. Unless we don't know if you're white. And then you'll be like, listen, you just can't say it. And then, like, black people will be like, uh, but I say it. <laughs> so, fuck you. That's racist. Yo, you off the physics yet? The gizics. Gizzy, did you die silently as fuck? Or, like, what happened? He'll, he'll answer in an hour. I was just reading about covalent, bipolar, uh, ribo, nuclear explosions in, his, in my pants. Like, it's proven that, like, white men can dunk. And it's also been proven that white men can dance. 
Well, I almost went into Christopher Walken there. But if Giz isn't going to talk, then you just go crazy. I could. Oh, fuck. I'd like to record the setup, but it's just not important. Like, there's no information in the setup. Giz, can you see the stream? I think I have all the sounds turned off, so if Giz leaves, I don't even fucking know. I'll talk to Giz for three hours, and dude's not even fucking here. Wait, Giz, aren't you still in New York City? Dude, okay, the question is now, would Giz actually bounce from such a nice setup? Let's see. No, he's right fucking there. Giz, you're right fucking there. His name is Giz. He is the whiz. Dummies. He's... Oh, fuck. I know I fucked that up. What the fuck? I just keep posting my fucking Discord link. Because that's... Yeah. Okay, that's not what we want. One, two, three, four, five. Shift. Uh, up, 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 and see. Delete. Okay, so we have plenty of time. Giz may open his fucking pie hole or not. Funny things that like Giz is if if I was like a fake me like how do you fake me like how do you fake Master Beethoven like how do you fuck like fake Cosmos Death how do you fake the Chosen how do you fake Hyperbully or Hey Zeus or Artillery Shell Silver you can't fake that shit it's too hard that's what she said. And there's some there's a star on the moon, dude. There's a fucking star on the on the moon like a star upon the chest of the fucking sneeches upon the beaches. This is how I'm gonna have to teach it. Dude, the moon is not flat. Giz, like but don't be a fucking flat moon moonanite. A moonanite, I think. Or a lunatic or a luna. That's lunacy. Yo, Giz, the, the, I'm just going to give you the answers, but there's no money. But you're in Manhattan. You should drive to New York City, like far western New York City, like in two weeks, and like do some communist work on camera with me and eat really well and, and then discuss like what happens when we create our first deep fake lake. It might, it, dude, Giz, we might build a lake that only has six properties on it, right? Like, like a hexagonal lake. The dynamite explosions or whatever we use are going to be spectacular. Like we're hopefully going to blow the whole thing up in one shot. And then we're going to flood it with water. And then we're going to like send these floating machines that like, it's a long story, but they, they turn the dirt, they, they mix the dirt into the water and then we suck it like right the fuck out. Amazing, and it's going to be deep, too. That's what she said also, C-H-I. It's the energy, the green energy of life from, I think the panda movies invented it. Kung, Kung Fu Panda. Who, who's, who's the fool? The fool are the fools who go to the fool's school. No, oh, but school's cool. Yeah, but is it hot? It's not. Giz, I'm pretty fucking high. Giz, you see that shit? Fucking see that shit? You sound unhappy, Gilmore. You too good for your hole? 
Nice setup. Dude, this is the, this is, I, I told Giz, this is Master Beethoven level, dude. You, it doesn't get any better than this. Like, for the trash that I work with, dude, for the trash that I am, this is the top of the mountain. <laughs> Yeah, Giz doesn't laugh at my jokes that much. I don't know if I'm not funny or you just have a weird sense of humor. I would get those chairs a little bit closer. What do you mean? Why? What? Why would I do that? Oh, for just visual Keyboard effects? Is five or... minutes five minutes away from falling into the fire. Five minutes? Dude, this shit is sweet as fuck. Dude, Giz is going to come. You're going to bump right? it. Giz... You're going to bump it with your thigh and then it's going to fall in the fire. And I'm going to laugh. <laughs> Listen, it actually looks like it's fucking hovering. Kev, this, like, Kev. 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 What? So there's, there's some, what is it? It's mind, space, time, share, port, land. What comes after land? Mind, spa mind space, share, mind, space, time, mind, space, time, share, port. Land or what, what comes after port? Are there any words that come after port? Because like, kind of like supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. There's things that you can say they're insane that are all portmanteaus, or just portal. Po uh, po uh, sh share port alex share port no that ends at alex or share port alex and er grambulance. Dude, I'm gonna build. Uh, we're gonna build RVs, Kevin. You're gonna design a lot of shit. I'm sure. Like. Talking and, and using Blender. Like, we're going to build RVs, electric RVs. Before, Like, we're going to be old, right? We're going to be fucking old. But they're going to be fucking amazing. And, and people are going to travel in them as part of our, you know, our an, an, an narco-com. An it's a narcom, right? It's a nar an narco-communism. It's hilarious. Like a rom-com, sort of? Uh, like, like a bomb-com. Like bomb, bomb comedies. Like, and that's like refugees, like, like these, well, not refugees, but like Arabs, like having like a wedding, you know, and it's the funniest wedding in the world, right? We literally get all the Jewish writers. It's the funniest wedding in the world. And, and then it just ends with like a, a, a like the incidental damage. Like we show that there's a criminal over here and then you like see the missile and like they all die, but it's really funny until they die. And then that's just the whole thing, right? The movie just ends like seven minutes, like, fuck you, like, fuck you people. Seven minutes in, it's over. <laughs> I mean, the, the, one of the best things about, like, the future for us and decentralized studio work is that when we release a piece of entertainment, the audience doesn't know how long it is, right? Like, they don't know. It could be it could be a minute. It could be fucking four hours. Like, if they want to spoil it themselves, like, they can. But, like, if they like if you don't know when something ends, it can be much more powerful. We, we could run the world in a way. Like, I, we, we could, like maybe end up as like the biggest dicks out there like playing the same games as like the Bezoses but like just say instead of one guy it was like Lancelot and and Sir Robin you know it was like 13 guys and instead of one guy I mean I think I could take all of them you know that like not just it's not like intellectual horsepower so much as it's like intellectual horsepower times a quarter century like I did seven Gladwells Kev seven Gladwells 70,000 hours and my dad may give me a dollar an hour to invest in tools and if i do that you better be at the house every fucking day like if i get an extra workstation like you, there will not be a lot of cash for you but there will be no cash for me but what you can do is earn a pretty batshit amount of stock per hour of blender work like it's to the point that it'll be a little bit obscene like you're not going to make a thousand x like maybe you make fifty dollars an hour doing blender like you're not going to make fifty thousand an hour but you could easily 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 500 an hour in, in stock. If you're designing original products from our brand, from Mine Rand. Sorry, sorry, what? So I get carried away. Mine Rand. Rand. Mine Rand is kind of funny. Um, there's Mine Stein. Mine Steins are great, dude. Like my, it's just, it basically means like what you hold inside your own head, but we can also make Mine Steins that are like mugs and they can hold a ton of data too. Like you just, like if you have a mug that sits on the table and it's kind of heavy and like you can, sp you can wind it up like a thousand turns, people will wind that shit up and it'll stay charged and it'll keep your data and it's a cold wallet anyways. Kev, you're going to get to design, you're in one of the best positions in the world. I know you're a little pissed off at uh, the hyper capitalists or the handy capitalists, whatever you call them. But like you're gonna, you're like in in a system of freelance a lot. Like a huge amount of 
work is going to be available of thousands of types every day to, like to do design and the refinement of design and to make the actual products we put out of factories more beautiful and 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 not ju like not just the main products but like every time we release a product it'll be kind of com universitary and like the dimensions will be pretty fucking standardized for the actual pieces of that fucking product and we'll say to anyone in the world whether it's a normal customer buying some add-on for their house or actually buying a car like a super car garage house themselves um if you invent something that connects to two points in your house right if you like it's all basically a truly modular system so if you invent something for your own you know dome like dome my god like if you invent something for your own dome it then like you could absolutely just for the idea and and you should probably make it work in your own house first but like you could get royalties for for every single person out there who is is in that model of home who just wants the same thing even if they just build it themselves you still might get like two dollars or two cents i don't know it's up you know it's up to the community it's not none of that shit should ever be up to to a dude you, you don't want to trump people you don't want to trump children it's fucking crazy it's like it's like the pepe pal failed like epically for for a reason hey yoda uh it's just yo duh hey yoda <laughs> hey yoda what's up what do you think a photo of a light bulb in outer space traveling the galaxy with a sailing boat inside the light bulb looks like? I mean, I missed some of that, but like I'm imagining a kid's book like with a light bulb that flies through space and it's, it's pretty beautiful. I don't I missed yeah, I, some though. I typed it out and start work. Yeah, I can't uh, the, my com I can't see anything. That it, and I'm glad as I can see the moon. I can luna see. Kev, you guys the luna tokens are going to be great. Kev, do you realize that Orbit coin is real? Like there, there will be a bit a Bitcoin with 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 twenty one satellites in space at different altitudes and shit, right? Like they will be in every different fucking. There'll be a geostationary. Like all we need to really maintain is one, right? In an emergency, all you need is one node to propagate from if your system's trusted. And if you trust your chain enough, you don't even keep the chain. Like, there's no chain. There's just the block. or I mean, the block is not the word, but, like, there's just the link. Like, you have the present state. If you don't trust it enough to erase all that other bullshit, fuck off. And I'm the data guy, right? I mean, people keep it, but you don't have to. It doesn't, it doesn't matter if you're doing things right. Didn't a Luna coin collapse already? No, no, I, I mean my Luna coin. I mean, like, no, no. Okay, it's Luna token. It's not Luna. It's not Luna coin. It's Luna token. That doesn't really mean anything. The Luna token is nothing. What the Luna token would be is probably like. Uh, I bet it would like if you bought it. Like everyone who owned it would be sent a Luna token, which would be a coin, on one side of which really looked like the moon and could light up at night, and the other side was a, a small Coke mirror. And that's your cold wallet too. And when you spin it on the table, it's got a little motor in the middle, and it it like you can use it to do things. I mean, mainly it's just your cold wallet, right? But if you need to give it power, if you want to use it as a computer, also you spin it. And if it and if it lands on the moon side, then you can go and do what you want to do. And if, and if it lands on the, the coke mirror side, well, dude, the moon looks like an ice cream cone flying through space. Like I think Giz said something about a light bulb, but literally, okay, the moon looks like. An ice cream bulb. It looks like an ice cream cone with a fucking bulb in it. Flying, like, not flying, it's just sitting there. Right? Like, instead of ice cream, it's the moon. <laughs> it's pretty awesome. So, Kev, uh, Orbit Coin, real, is real. Rabbit Coin, is real. Like, these kids will f make these rabbits fuck. And I know people think rabbits fuck faster than they do, but, like, to grow the coins in Rabbit Coin, it, do, it takes some time for the babies to be fucking made. And I think at the end, you have to make rabbit soup out of them, right? Like, if you want to cash in your rabbit coin and, and like, buy stuff, and there's inflation, so you should, um, you got to, like, make rabbit soup with your rabbits. Oh, do we get to tell kids so many awesome things? So many awesome it's things. Like Tamagotchi you're talking about? I don't really know Tamagotchi. Like, I know Tom. You remember that, right? Mugachi. I've heard. I know it, but I don't. I couldn't. I couldn't tell you. Is that an art movement or a person? Like, what is that? 
It's a toy from the 90s. A toy? What does it do? It was like a little Game Boy <laughs> thing. You had to, like, take care of a pet. It was this oh, pet oh, movie. okay, okay. And what pet were we talking about? I'm pretty high right now. It was, uh, this, like, little, um... Oh, rabbit coin. Oh. No, it was rabbit coin. Oh, but I'm saying, like... Well, I, I like that stuff, too. I actually think we're gonna... Dude... We're going to sell both flat earth coins, right? We're going to sell flat earth coins that literally inside them have a book, right? And, and all that book might be is is like Q, the Q army, right? It might be the Q army, like a bunch of images. And you flip through the book, and if you scan any of those images, it takes you to that fucking artist, right? And all the guy gets is 100 pixels by 100 pixels, which is 10,000, which is a myriad. And Myriad is probably one of the only great names left. And I wanted Myriad Adventures, but somebody has Myriad Adventures, like, at Gmail. And I think, like, if, it's, if they don't have the Gmail, they don't have the idea. Um, but Myriad Advantages, Myriad Advantages I got. And Myriad Advantages is, like, a more, more entendre, entendresque, entendresque, I don't know, entendresque, entendre-like. I'm entendre-tarded. Okay, it's time to time to meditate for five seconds. What is an entendre anyway? I, I, multiple meanings of a word, I think. I mean, but wait, what was the word? I totally forgot it. <laughs> what the fuck? Entendre tarded. No oh, fucking the whole time I'm just recording a blank screen. Cap, we got to play a little uh, hangman here. Entendre tarded. I. <laughs> Dude, one of these days I'm like, can you see the screen, Kevin? No, somebody's got to see the screen. Um, yeah, it's on there. But why are you Why aren't you answering? What? I've been writing to you. You have to watch the stream, or you can't see the I words. Said, can you read this? Yeah, but I was saying, like, Kevin, speak, and you're like, you didn't say anything. It's, what is it, pay to talk? Fuck push to talk. It's pay. No, 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 sorry. It's invest, invest to talk, right? I don't think I like typing. Fuck typing. We're not doing typing. Oh, fuck, I don't even know if I can get to that window with my mouse work. Isn't that a building in Malaysia, the Taiping? <laughs> it could be. I mean, you can troll me. Can't you can troll me? Yeah, you can troll me. You control us. It goes like this. You control me, but you don't have to. But you can. But you don't have to. But you should. But you don't have to. Yeah, Kev, they can definitely troll us, and we're going to eat the trolls. We're going to eat the Nega Trolls, and we're going to help the good Nega Trolls to unite into Mega Troll. And then Posit Troll is going to fucking destroy Mega Troll. He's, even, he's funnier, and he's smarter, and he's better than you. Dude, Chepa says that. He's like, I'm, I'm bigger than you, I'm smarter than you, <laughs> and I'm better. Than, it's so funny. It's so funny, um, at least to hear Chepa say that. Like, just, like, I work in security, so, I mean, I know security. Insecurity. I know insecurity. Everyone knows insecurity. I'm an insecurity guard. I'm an insecurity guardian angel fishing. Wait, angel fishing is a thing, right? There's cat fishing and, and tiger fishing. Um, teach a man to fish with a PH. I don't mean acidity, I mean like a scammer. Um, Kev. Kev, do you know Giz? Yeah, we've met online at least. Giz, Giz, Giz should come to New York shitty. Isn't he from Buffalo? No, he's from New York City. We're from New York shitty. Yeah, Have you ever been in New York City? Yeah, who's that? Hey. Hey, who's that? Yo. 
Is that, it sounds doing? like is that it's either it's either Giz putting on doing. Are you doing black voice? Like what the fuck, dude? We'd have a show if I were black. We'd have a show funny. called you know called him? the like black. It'd be called Black Voice. <laughs> it's called something named Benny. Fuck. No. I don't know Benny. I know Ben Dover. Benjamin Dover. Wait, is there somebody named Benny in here? Like, I can't see, Kev. Are you three retarded? Like, what the fuck? Yes, What's there's someone named Benny in here. Dude, my, my four accounts have averaged more words than you people. Kev, what's new? Anything? What's new? Which which conspiracy? Like, which thing in the... Like, which new thing? Which new crazy thing have you heard of? Like, I'm Alex uh, Jonesing. I'm fucking Alex Jonesing right now, so hit me up with some Alex okay, Jones. Um, a Freemason gave me the contact info of every single embassy of every single government on the entire planet. And I mass emailed like 4,500 of them at the same time. The solution to poverty in my new constitution. Any responses? Like any security agencies? Or are you good? So far, so good. Uh, apparently, they're trying to track me down and ask me where I got all those email accounts right now. Why is there a big yellow ball in the middle of the screen? What the fuck is... Who is that? It's saying things. He's writing to me in a fucking balloon. It's Benny. Dude, that's sweet as fuck. Did you see that shit, Kev? What is behind you? That dude is... Huh? What's behind com- you? My computer's behind me. So, was it making noise? What are you, what are you no, looking just, at? Just look at the... Uh, I gotta hide my screen right now so it's squares instead of... Um, look, at the, look at the stream, dude. Look at how cool it is. He, like... This dude has a ball, has a balloon. He's a, he's a balloon attack. Look at this shit, dude. Balloon attack. It's a balloon. It's balloonacy, dude. A, bo- a balloon. A balloon. What is it? No. Uh, a bo- What's a balloon corn? Describe it quickly. Ten thousand D's. Did you build that table? Kevin, it's just a piece of wood. <laughs> like yes, I put it on my lap. <laughs> You're a very good craftsman. Yeah, I'm a craftsmanson. Okay. I'm a Minecrafter. I just need to be reminded anyway, like, after. <laughs> like 48 hours after I sent this email, the entire UK government collapsed and like everyone resigned. <laughs> wait, so on a scale of one to ten, um, wait, how magical is your thinking? Is it magical? Or like, I feel like you are 50 percent uh, maga tr- maga troll. Are you maga yeah. troll? Are you MAGA trolling? I'm 50% mega troll, and then 50% genius, and you don't know no. which is which. No, you don't. You don't know like, which takes over. It's it's MAGA troll. I, th- I think because you, yeah, you pretend you pretend to believe in Jesus, like Jesus, like on, Jesus. On my bullet points, <laughs> on my bullet points, I said uh, the last one was we can make America great again, and then parentheses if you're into that thing. If not, that's fine too. Yo, what if you're a guy, what if you're an assassin of things? Like, what if you, like, like just start shooting things with, like, bullets that have messages inside of them, right? Like, your bullet points. Like, in each bullet is, like, and the bullet does not destroy, right? It just breaks whatever it's, it's fucking, like, you shoot, like, the, 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 the Philadelphia Liberty Bell or something. You just shoot it. And they're, like, how long can you go to prison for just shooting things when there's no people around? It's probably not that long, and it would be a hilarious trial. We're just going to make the trial. Right, and whenever like, and we go through the people will be pissed. As we go through the mock trot, well, I mean, sure, but are they gonna like execute me for it? Like, I'm like, it made a funny sound. Like, the people realize no one's being shot, but there's a sniper out there, (laughs) and he's like shooting things, like bad things. It seems fun. It seems amusing to me. There's also going to be something, there's going to be a movie we film where everybody in the movie is a sniper and everybody has a sniper rifle, except it really is just a camera. I mean, it may shoot, like, Nerf balls or something. It may shoot Nerf flechettes or something. Like, you may be able to shoot a high arcing shot at your friend who's also. But the point is, like, to 
which doesn't work in this scenario, to aim the guns at like capitalists, like really scummy people, and record their intimate moments through your the camera and your sniper rifle before you shoot them. And it ends like that other thing. It's just it's just like when the U.S. bomb explodes and and the wedding is fucking murdered because we're you scared. Can do with, uh, you can do that with airsoft. It would work with airsoft. Airsoft is fucking like it. Uh, uh, in a movie, maybe I'd consider anything not airsoft. Like, we need a better fucking gun system for fuck's sake. Like, we need a better, we need a reusable ammunition. Does it work as well in like the forest? No. But like, when you have real battles, like, you want to be able to fire at high rates and you want to be able to do so for low cost. You need, and the only, the only option is, the only ammunition option that works is spheres. Like, nothing else works like a sphere. Nothing. Dodgeballs, tennis balls, and super balls alone. I mean, you need a little armor, right? You definitely need some carbon fiber armor, whatever it is, like the modern lightweight version. Maybe full-on exercise suits that, like, like in an hour you're just wrecked, right? Like after an hour you can't even walk anymore, and you're like eject, and like you and you get out of your fucking exercise suit. But you can handle being hit by a dodgeball, a super ball, or a tennis ball. And you know, if you want to shoot Super Bowls, you get a lot more of them because they're small, right? You can machine gun. I mean, you could technically machine gun from a dodgeball cannon, but, like, that's really expensive. Like, it's paper shot. Like, the amount of energy that you use as you shoot lowers your score in Satoshis and Photons. What did Guy Fox say? Absolutely nothing. Because it's a joke. He said, remember, remember, the 5th of November. He said, remember, remember, the 7th of 11. The 7th, the 7th of 11th. The four profiteer convenience stores right at the center of your neighborhood. Sweet as fuck. Dude, at least they should have, like, like, the communists should have, like, an amazing convenience store chain, right? Like, we need to, like, we need to strike, not Starbucks, but 7-Eleven, get the fuck out, and, and start actually connecting with all the people. Like, even, out, we'll do it in the village. I think we should unite the village evict 7-Eleven by some emergency decree and build prove that a community does not have to be fucking stupid like I'll stay I'll stay in Buffalo for a year and apply the full power of Meinstein to whatever the problems without you know demanding that my solutions are adopted the adoption of my solutions is uh, it's adoptional it's myriad adoptional it's there's a myriad of possible adoptions and adoptics. I don't know how you would adopt optics. I got some of those psych optics. Like I like, I squeeze my nose and I blow. I should get up and, and call that an episode of whatever the fuck this is. I like the copyright-free uh, ancient classical music. Kev, do you have a what you consider to be a class sickle? No, I don't. I don't. I'm not down with that. Class sickles, like like uh, but what do you mean? Like Explain. The Soviet, like the Soviet flag. Are you, oh, you're talking about That's the, the so. Classical. You're talking about the Soviet Union. That's just like a water co-op, yeah. dude. The fuck? They scared the shit out of you. There's no disputing. I don't even want to dis, dis or Raz Putin. I don't even want to dis or Raz Putin. Like, that's like the one guy that with the wrong... Um... Neuro neurological event could end everything like this lake would there'd be still some shit alive in it probably but like the fallout keep in mind you know what they, they do in the united states in the future they literally just build a, a a what is it it's a i think nine to the 13th redundant doomsday machine and we get rid of all of our weapons and we're like if anyone actually like, we're going to work to stop this. We have, like, think about this. A billion dollars buys you a million thousand dollar drones, Kev. Like, you could, like, the, the world could be blanketed by something that's akin, a cousin to intercommunism. 
but it would be like first cousins to enter communism. There would be a microphone everywhere. And I'm not just like 1984 playing. Freedom is more important than privacy. Like real freedom is yeah, more important. Microphones everywhere, always recording. No, no, well, it's not. It's not so much that they're recording. Um, it's more like if somebody screams help, you know. I mean, it is kind of recorded, but the AI puts it into you know like temporary storage and never listens to it. It 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 only listens for a few words, and even then, if there's any if there's any indication of a true crime, it's sent to a decentralized jury of arbitration. Our bit rations. And our arbit rating, to, the, the, those words kind of mix together. Um, and twelve, if twelve people vote that it's fucked up, then then it, and then if it's a small crime or like something something happened to somebody, and it's not that serious, then if twelve people say yes, then definitely that person is going to be asked to come to the next um, downtown hall, like the next downtown hall, or or maybe they'd be arrested. Maybe it'd be like, listen, we need. Uh, some vigilantes <laughs> like like we need to get this guy and if you have you know pistol training and you have body armor you know meet here and we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna get a posse to go get this pussy but if it's a serious crime you'd be like okay 12 people said yes then it would immediately spread out to 144 and i'm talking citizens from all over the world on this you know israeli network and if all one if all 144 people say execute like then that person is killed <laughs> like they're killed but the only way a person's killed is if 12 people say execute and then 144 people say execute and most of the time that happens because they believe that someone else is going to be fucking killed but like all the robots can literally require at their core like to and and it's a joke anyways none of the weapons are fatal like we're like if we get in a situation when our penetrating tranquilizer darts and and other i mean we, tank defeating devices actually how do you beat a tank like if you get rid of lethal weapons how the fuck do you stop a tank you probably have to you know what you do you fly up to it with a drone and you blow gas in into the into the fucking barrel or you you should write you should write a constitution no, I'm writing a choose your own constitution. It's like a it's a fractaling thing. Um, I think a pathway will be discovered that that looks a lot like an army marching through your city. You know, the, along the lines of the hexagons. Kev, we're gonna make a deep fake lake that's only a hexagon. Bring your army into my city? Huh? No, no, You're no. It's just that army into my city. No, it's just like settlers of Catan. I'm just saying the lines which surround every hexagon, the borders between them are the marching ways. You know, when a person walks into a hexagonal battlefield, um, they march along the lines. And and they have to surround a hexagon before the, the card inside is activated. We happen to have tons of cards, and they stack too, right? You could stack 10 of my cards, like 10 of your stories, and create like a super tower. Like if you get 10 good cards and they all have to connect, like there can be no cards that directly connect which do not connect. Um, you, you, you'd, like be, you'd be in a position where you're like, I'm probably gonna win this game just cause I built this tower. Like, and I can, I can protect myself at long ranges and I, like in such depth that they'll probably never come here and take me. And my people, like or the people in the neutral territories, they they will see this tower and they will move into my civilization. And you win by like getting the most people to just take your side. You have a better world. I'm joining it. It's not debatable. Debating has been mastered. <laughs> I'm your master, Beta. I'm your master, Vedic. I'm your master, Vader. Oh, it's Master Vader. What if somebody called him like that? Like, I don't know, maybe 25 years in the future, the so-called AIs will, like, it'll just make that for me. I'll, I, should, I could be alive. I'll be 75 years old. Like talking to computers that can procedurally blend trillions of human created assets and like trillions of scans, eliminating yeah. the necessity of all stands forever. There was, uh, 
I saw this new AI artwork generator that was like really good. It's crazy some of the shit they can do already. It's, I mean, it's not an AI, it's, but like, it's amazing. Like what, just what the, the algorithms and the processors can do. Like looking at themselves and refining themselves. And they probably are learning to please us, right? They're probably waiting. They're probably like looking at you and thinking, oh, he likes that. Yeah. They're probably just yeah. playing us like chess, and they don't know what the fuck they're. They don't know what the fuck they're doing. Like, like less than we know. Like the, the AIs have less are less conscious than sheep people. Like drastically less conscious than the least conscious human you've ever met. Much faster, but less conscious. Yeah, I want to sit at the on one of. I'm gonna find. Five, I gotta find five other guys. Or three other guys and three women. I think we're gonna take Ash and Sheba. Who who's the third? Who's the third? Ash, Sheba, and Rise. Eh? Or Mary. Right. What? Yeah, I hope you're writing some cool is the balloon guy still there? Yeah, I hope he's writing some cool shit. Like if he's super Kev, can you see this dude's yellow balloon? Kev. Kev, what's with this push to talk bullshit? Kev? Gizmo? What's up? Yo, would you, uh, would you burn your project to make my project succeed, guaranteed? No. <laughs> That's, well, I wouldn't either, faggot. I'm kidding. But, like... I think like it might it might not be the worst thing. Like if my project succeeds, do you really have to worry about yours? Like if we have if we have what is it? Um if we have chi, right? If we just have chi, co-optimized human intelligence, it doesn't like we will design and build amazing cities in all scenarios really. So like we more than a city, like we need what do we need more than a city? We just need a vision. And it doesn't. It can't be a visionaries, right? It can't be just for one of twelve signs and the greatest sign of all time. Like just because Aries can do it doesn't mean the rest of you fucking astro logicians can. Like I can't, sir. I just can't, sir. This other guy's a scorpion. He's a high scorpion. It's the right of the fail creeds. It's the right of the fail creeds. You're gonna fail creed. Sorry, shit just got rocky. And I'm most definitely not too pocky. Fuck, I'm gonna sneeze so. Ha! 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 Dude, if you don't sneeze on the beat, you die. Fuck. Oh my god, that was close. Go to Gizleaf? Yeah, that was a while ago. I don't have any sounds on. What about Balloon Guy? Can you tell me what Balloon Guy's saying? He's been subscribing. He's probably probably winning. He says Ahu. <laughs> okay. It's Benny. 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 It's me, Mario. Yeah, still. I don't know. Kev, what time is it? 11.30. That's not bad. Actually, my jaw hasn't been bothered. Like, I've been loosening up, actually, and I gotta go back home tomorrow, and I tore my apartment to shreds. Like, to get everything together. Like, everything I own is here, except, like, a TV and a chair. And my hockey skates, they're pretty nice, but the steel is just, like, rusted to fuck all. Kev, I, don't, I couldn't even, like, fix my own skates. Like, I couldn't even grind blades. Like, I, even my dad's grinder is trash. It's, tra it's, like, fucking 40 years old piece of shit. Like, you turn it on, it takes, like, three minutes before it starts spinning. It's not good. Uh, uh. And the moon, again, it looks like a giant fucking comet. It's frozen in space-time. It has a tail. What if it's just crashed to Earth right now? With this song playing. <laughs> I mean, it's really weird how, how it looks. I mean, because of the way it's facing. 
I see I those like Georgia it. Guidestones? I see what? Do you see the Georgia Guidestones got blown up? No. They were talking about them today, and I was just saying dumb. Do you look at the moon. Do you see the dude on it? There's like a dude. There's like a, a little monkey or something like reaching out for a cookie. Or maybe it's one of the guys from... I think it's maybe it's one of the guys from Space Invaders. You see, like, what is... You see that shit on the moon? Or, like, or maybe it's just, like, a, a just a two-legged uh, cyclops. I think it's just, like, an, a head and an eye and two legs. It's very hard to focus. There's some, there's some, like, misty clouds in front of it. But there's definitely, like, a man on the moon right now. Kev, what's the first kind of company that advertises on the moon? Three, two... One. Uh, Coca-Cola. Telescopes. What the fuck? Jesus Christ, people are stupid. Coca-Cola, what? <laughs> Pass. Oh, I used to play a game called Return Fire, and, like, when you'd capture the flag in, like, a fucking Jeep, like, this song would start playing, and, like, they'd start, the helicopters would come at you. I mean, they weren't very good. Like, that game was fun as shit. Like playing like real world return fire, like an overhead, like it. I, we, we gotta make that. that game was so fun. Towers everywhere. You got like a, you got a jeep, a tank, a, a rocket launcher, and a fucking helicopter. Like like I was in college. That game was so fun. Kev Trump is garbage. He's a garbage man. Like. He's a garbage man with 200,000 grand. Nothing against garbage men. It's an the insult. Savior of all of humanity. Save your bullshit for people who might believe in Jesus or Donald. Save your bullshit. Save your bullshit for people who buy bullshit. I don't buy bullshit. I'm thinking about selling bullshit. And recently I said that I was selling bullshit. But it's more like... Invest to bullshit, right? It's invest to bullshit. A bullshit, but like you are not buying tickets to to my show. Like you are investing in the company, and the thousand people who invest the most, they get to come to the show. I told you, show. I told you, socialists. Fucking socialists. You're so so socialist. You're so emotionless. Your job application has been rejected. Kev, what about Job Suck? You like it? Kev, what's the name of the author who wrote Jobs Suck? Um, I did. No, no. Think, My... think about the... No, the, the, the name of the book is Jobs Suck. For 10,000 Ds. No, Kev, make some money now. My, if you had cash, bio, you, you, you'd invest in me. My bio on Instagram is Steve Hates Jobs. Steve Hates Jobs. Okay, so you, then you should have been able to say Steve Works. For 10,000 Ds. You just lost 10,000 Ds. Kev, you know what 10,000 Ds is, right? Okay, Kev, it's actually, it's not just Ds. It's adjusted dollar equivalent, pronounced AIDS adjusted dollar equivalents or just like d's for short right it's aids or d's adjusted dollar equivalents like if we if we if i say ten thousand d's and you win it you get ten thousand dollars at that valuation you know if you got ten thousand dollars at the valuation of a thousand years ago you'd have a lot of money <laughs> right so you, inflation does not affect d's which is a crypto and I'm an open mic night with a K. Okay, Boomer? Are you okay? I am KK. okay, Boomer. No, I was saying, are you okay? And then you said nothing, and I said, KK. I never say KK. Like, what the fuck? Just one more K away. I mean, did, they, did anyone call them, like, nobody called those things hoodies, right? Like, those hoodies were nuts, though. Like, maybe you can see, like, those people out there, and they look, and they're like, fuck white people. <laughs> like, 
even if they did like invent the most shit, like they've also maybe done. Wait, have we, Kev? Have we done the worst shit or no? Or is that like Mao or something? And I mean, he's not. He's like Mao's worse. He's only like, but a Caucasian is only one step away from an Asian, right? So he's our cousin. So he's like. Yo, Kev, okay, Fifty Shades of Grey matters. Sorry, Fifty Shades of Grey matter. <laughs> it's, 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 it's Fifty Shady. It's Fifty Shady. Kev, you know that the real... Is that like a, like a elderly porno? <laughs> <laughs> it's not a Peppa porn. the world's tiniest violence. Kev, attacks are theft. They are. Correct. Oh, uh, did I tell you one of the new words is bipolaries? Or maybe it's bipolaries barely, because it's, cause it's like I'm bipolar barely, right? I'm bipolar barely. But I'm a werewolf and a black sheep in a dog eat puppy world where, like, at least the puppies can occasionally catch a squirrel. I offered Abraham a million dollars cash if he catches a live, uninjured, non rabid squirrel. Imagine if, like, you did that to your kid and he believed you and he was just, like, his obsession in life was just catching one squirrel. And then he finds out that my net worth is, like, eight grand. But Kev, what's your internet worth? Um, about a uh, hundred bucks. How many non-insane, competent, quote-unquote inventors with real skills have ever been able to work for twenty-five years, seventy-five thousand hours without having to sell one idea? Has that ever happened? And like, did did they just die? And like, their books were burned by their mom who didn't understand or? Has anyone ever, has any inventor worked for 25 years without building one of his ideas? Oh, like I guarantee with, it. And then they died, or like, what happened to them? Like, why wouldn't they patent it if they, like, because they're poor, right? Like, they're, or would it be rich kids? Would it would all be like rich kids who did this, right? They didn't have to work. They started thinking. They started writing down. They started finding ideas. Like, maybe there's, maybe I'm all over the place, right? Maybe we're like alien civilizations, but we just can't, like, find it because for, for me. Fur meme. It's a fur meme. Sorry, it's a furmy meme. They're called fur memes. I'm a philosopher. -y. You're a philosopher retard, which is a philosopher, a furry, and a retard. And if you think I'm talking to you, I'm actually talking to Kevin, but I'm talking through Kevin to you. Kev, you've you've got you've won zero Alex prizes tonight. Like, what's up? Um, I thought I won like one or two for laughing at your jokes. Okay, two, um, dollars, two Ds. So, if you can name twelve ideopolis, you can have ten thousand. And I'll make this video public, so like, and you'll have a link to it. And you can scream. Rabbit coin. If you get twelve, okay, that's one. Rabbit coin is one. If you get twelve, no, no, ten thousand Ds. You could you could put you could have it in whatever form we have available. If it's rabbit coin, if it's mind space time, if it's lunar token, if it's black coal token, if it's the element token, if it you know, I think I said orbit coin right. If it's Oreos, there's a there's a, there's a, a derivation of EOS called Oreos. I ask people, do you like Bitcoin Oreos? And they're like, what's Bitcoin Oreos? The, it's money that you eat, right? They're cookies, and you and they're worth money, <laughs> but you eat them. And if you don't, they'll go bad. Like, but you can, in theory, if you keep them sealed, right? They come in like missile tubes. We're gonna sell a bunch of like foods, Kevin, in rocket tubes, right? Like, and if you buy one of our electric rocket motor engines, <coughs> you can you can fire that tube of cookies into the sky, and they pack fine. A hundred by a hundred, like one inch, like two inch, whatever. Pass. It's a hundred by a hundred tubes that are an inch and a half each. That's like probably fit. No, it doesn't fit on a crate. How how wide is a pallet? Like three feet? Yeah, pallet is uh 
I think like 42 by 48 inches, something like that. Yo, yo, if anybody starts selling you on building with existing uh, trailer or uh, shipping container stock, what we probably need to do, like when Vanderbilt like basically invented manufacturing processes for steel to build the bridge over to Mississippi. Wait, what are we talking about? Like right before the right before the rabbit hole on the Vanderbilt? That was a bad one. We're talking about you giving me money. No, no, what was the last thing that you remember? You can get some more D's. I, uh, I, I don't know. I have no idea what I was started talking about. Well, that's gay. This is very like liberty and having been canceled. And I called a white guy the N-word six times. I got instantaneously canceled for all time and space. I mean, I'm still not a racist. I'm not even fucking basic. I'm not fascist or a racist. I'm not basic. I'm acid. Vicious. Acid vicious. Like Sid Vicious? Get it? I'm going to get off Michael Scott free for all of these ones. Michael Scott free... I'm open Mike I'm open Mike Scott. How about that? I'm open Michael Scott. Dude, that'd be great. That really lowers the standard way the fuck down. <laughs> like push a talk makes me want to threaten Redrum spelled backwards. My name is Alex like sorry, Alexy like Alexy. Or fallacy, if you want to impress me. I'm oppress me. You don't press me. You're not a press. You're an oppressor. Dude, that fucking balloon guy is still there, like probably crushing Camelot. You know, like I'm try I'm like this is some Titanic shit on my end and there's like a yellow balloon <laughs> competing with the moon. Wow, Alex, the AI drew you. <clears throat> if that's an AI, that'd be cool as fuck. Kev, what an AI is, it's an eyeball that sticks to any surface. I don't know what the invention is that somebody else made that sticks to any surface, <clears throat> but it's an eye. It's an eye. It definitely attaches to the bottom of like flying saucers that are they're so light that you can have one fly around your house with you. It, it so this is the crazy thing a a, fly, a flying well what do they call a perspective zeppelin um, or a flying saucer to get through your doorways like the ones that actually have like if you want to like be like eighty years old and FaceTime your your grandkids and and just look up at a flying saucer that's like turning into a cartoon. Those are, like, wider in normal flight than can fit through a doorway. So they have to turn sideways, right? They turn their internal ballast. And these are things that can, like, hang around in your fucking house and be, like, microphones and cameras for you so you never have to touch anything. And a lot of people just have a house with uh, a crazy device in the ceiling. It's, I mean, it's a ceiling fan air cleaner, sure, but it also has, like, a fucking robotic arm that can reach out and grab and any point in the house any point in the house and it has like 12 different hands that are like magnetically attached to the ceiling so it can like do it can pick you up like if you're old like it's a single arm that can do like mad shit probably need two arms if you're really old and you want it to like pick you the fuck up what does that arm cost it's like twenty eight thousand dollars like when we build a million at a time the brain is already in the house it's really just strength and joints and actuators and, and intelligence I mean, the hands are tough. Like, building great robotic hands is difficult, but, like, there's thousands of kids, there's thousands of ingenious kids like us or worse or better that are, like, out there right now and they're doing their schoolwork and they probably read some cool shit, but, like, all those kids could probably get sucked into a trutopia, like, a world that is legitimately operating according to, like, paradigms and ideas that, that, are real i mean they may not exist yet right but like and like literally have a world that is 
actually achievable from where we are now, depending on like what, what the time scale might be. And then, and then you create pathways for beautiful achievements. And we don't have that shit. We don't have virtue worth. Like we don't have it. Virtue worth is part of the V army and the V army. Which is part of the army, just the O-U-R slash M-E. The, and the dis, the dis army, the dis army. Like, maybe you can harm money, but you can't harm the harmony. The disarm, harmony. Why do you get a disarmaments? It's a job creating industry. Kev, you should come up with a definitive def defensive weapon system. That's I the did part already. I need. No, you didn't. You you are more delusional than me. Like you you like I believe that many of my ideas will get built in time. And, I had a uh, twenty millimeter cannons, anti tank cannons. Yeah, but tanks. Like, what do you do when a million EMP drones. shielded drones? Yeah, what do you do? Like, like, remember these things. These things, when released from space, right? They're released from fucking space above North Korea and the the the, the United Nations, like with a K, the U. United Nations, listen, um, when, when they drop these drones, like, they'll spread out over North Korea. A million of them is enough, and they're only a 1,000 each. And every artillery gun that fires, they will find it. They will triangulate the sound, and one of them will suicide that gun. So most guns won't get off more than one shot at Seoul, Korea, and they'll probably fake, like, a nuclear disaster in Seoul to evacuate, although that could risk, like, being hit by a nuke from, you know, Jin Yang. Jin Yang is like a fucking Korean kid from Silicon Valley on HBO. But he's a funny dude. Funny Chinese kid. I don't I don't know of like that many awesome Chinese people. I, I feel like China is like closed. Maybe it's like closed in a way that like literally doesn't produce people like us. Like, maybe you can't sit by a lake. Like, maybe in China, if you sit by a lake like this, like, somebody's going to see you and, and the party's going to come visit. And be like, uh, so, a little bit extra. And I don't know if Asian voices have already been canceled. Kev, I have probably a dozen ideas, like, ready in case I wake up tomorrow when I'm black. It's not on purpose. It just happened like that. You get more ideas when you're black? No, no, no. Like, black whole foods and black crackers. Like, and there's so many black... I'd make everything black. I'd make black milk. Like, dark black milk. Um, it might not work. <laughs> um... Definitely black crackers, black sugar, dude. Black sugar, come the fuck on. You tell me like black sugar, black powder is a movie that I would star in instantly. Black holistic. Um, what other? Maybe there's not twelve. Maybe there's only like seven. Oh, I had like a twisted tea. Alcohol does not make you feel good. It makes you feel bad. Like a bad person and then awful. What you drinking at night? Um Oh, it's Benny. Um I know I know right. many I know many Bennies. Many Benny. Is this just any this is not just any Benny. He's in Benny, and he's got like a fucking right. yellow balloon. Fuck Benny! Right. Fuck Benny. Oh, fuck. I can't. 
Kevin, I'm not writing. Why am I sitting here at this stupid fucking desk on my left, Kevin? You and your compliments, like, oh, nice desk. It's stupid. It's like I have wood on my knees, dude. And the splinters and bees. Indeed. Oh, fuck. Kev, what was the funny open mic word for 1,000 bees? Uh, Benny, just play Kevin for now. Benny, say philosophy out loud correctly for 10,000 Bs. Fine. It's asking for a friend, and obviously you're not one. We need to be friends. See, that's, that sounded like Nate. Like Nate, sure, it's Nate, sure. That's nature. Never. Wait, you sound bored. Of course not. <laughs> oh, dude, I would. What I would give to be able to like instantly switch to like, I don't know, just dozens of beautiful voices. What's that called? Oh, fuck. Uh, fuck. Meta voice? No. Uh, fucking. It's part of Deep Fate. But, like, to be able to, like, just. Deep Fate is when, like, you know, you want to play with other people's faces. Like, you just have to let them use yours, too. Like, no one goes in the system who can't also be, be Deep Fated. But the voice version, like, just, just to be able to. And just meet people and be like, yo, your voice is bombed. Can I have it? Like, can I use it as a character? And if you use it, I mean, maybe they get approval, right? Before you actually publish your, whatever your skit or your movie, you're like, yo, please, like, I, I use your voice for this. What do you think? And if they say no, it's probably not that good anyways. Or they're a fucking pussy. There's no way Benny likes pussies. Never. He, never. Like... You know, maybe Benny, Benny could be like a 99-year-old savant genius Italian great-grandmother just typing in these words, and, and when she presses return, it just says it in that voice. Like, AIs can definitely talk if you type to them. That's like the funny show. Like, get in a voice channel where everybody has to type the words, and then the words are read by their, their best voice. Like, that would be bomb. I could type really fast. I'm an excellent deriver. I'm the brain man. Sorry, the sovereign man. I'm the sovereign man. Oh, Kevin. Where the fuck are yeah. you? So, uh, I got a new one. It's when it rains, it pours. It's so good. Like, I really like it. Um, I don't have, like, tons of stupid, like, anecdotal sayings, but when it rains, and it pours is good. And it's really I've heard appropriate. That one. No, no, no. But it's spelled differently, and it's really appropriate for you and your fan of like monarch butterfaces or whatever you call them, monarchs. Your monarch enemy, your mononarchism, your mononarchical jism. Wait, what are we talking about? Wait, why am I talking about what was the word? Like now, I forgot. What the fuck? Cut. Kev, what did I just ask you? When it rains, it pours. Oh, yeah, yeah. You, can you write it down? I'll do it for this fucking guy. This guy, Benny. He tries harder than all of you fucking. Because, like, fucking Jordan shoes. Dude, this, dude this, is, this is a funny dude. If I'm not recording, I'm going to kill myself. Okay, can you see the screen? Kev. Kev. Benny. Gizmo. The Troller. Mars. Mickey. Goblet. X. Kevin. But if 
I do this, then I can't see what Benny's doing. But I couldn't see what Benny was doing anyways. I just know that it's there, and I think he drew my fucking shoe. I hope he also loves the Jews, too. Because I have to. Seriously, this isn't recorded. I'm going to fucking fuck myself up. Yo, Benny, can you say some shit? Yeah. Wait, again? What's going on? It's good, thanks. <laughs>